Welcome to HTML4 video series and this is part 21 and we are continuing with the div and last time uh, what we uh, did was we finished with headers, menu and footer so let's uh, finish up with the content and if you remember the table uh, table session uh, what we did was you get minimized okay what we did was like this was a complete row and we divided the whole row into three sections using the three TDs left middle and right and then we apply some width and height and it worked out so in case of dev it doesn't work like that it has some different techniques and some different pattern so over here within dev we have to nest the other devs like this so I'm going to copy this guy and I'll be coming over here and I'll paste I think this will do and this will do all the first and uh, all the first now let's uh, I have saved this portion so let's see what do we have in the browser you can see left uh, middle and right shows up and they take the space accordingly well that's a bit nice and you can see the dev is growing automatically I didn't I don't need to control the dev you know if I uh, apply <coughs> you know the height and all then I may uh, mess up the system but I want to see where is my people right so whereas oops I need to capture this guys actually I want to see like how much space is occupied by each one so I can go like this style double quote and close I am occupying two pixel okay and okay alt f s now let's check that out Alt F5. Yes, they are occupying space and they are bit like the way they should be. Alright, now what I need to do is I need uh, to make the left and right smaller and middle to be proportionate size. So what I'll do is I'll go with width, width, okay, and the width will be a 20%. Okay, copy this guy. Width will be 20%, 20% and and this is going to be 60 and I'm going to put this guy as 19 because I'm apply I have applied the border so right won't fit in so now you can see the let me change the color this is red you turn green and you turn blue all the first F5. So now you can see uh, you are how much space we are allocating for left, right, and middle. You can see over here. Now our next job is to move the middle up and stick with left, and move the right up and stick it to middle, right? So how can we do that? So like I mentioned earlier, there's a property called as float, which says uh, which I'm using over here is float colon left. When I see like this, what it does is it pushes the content you know beneath the left which was middle and it pushes up right and now if I want to move the right fellow up I need to do the same exercise over here alt fs and let's see what just happened why the right didn't move up did I messed up anything uh, float left what is wrong with that float left uh, do I need to apply is the middle is too high 1960 no 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 everything's good then where's the problem let me try this float left it should work actually yep so now the whole div you know has moved right and to the up upper section I think the problem was caused by I think this div not sure because this guy should have brought it up anyways uh, so this div is footer let's see alright so we have the sections now and uh, let's set the main height uh, height let's set the height height I'm just setting the height in here for the demo purpose right so height would be let's say 250 pixel semicolon all the first and let's have a preview okay 250 is my height 
and same height I need to apply to my main container alt fs and, and let's have a look now actually we have the space because what you did was the div which was inside the big div which is this one it doesn't have the height and this guy actually completely moved out and jumped over him so basically uh, I have applied the height so this guy will completely push this guy down and then there will be no overlapping in between them right okay so height is 250 let's copy that paste and paste all of us and now you can have the complete all down right and mostly this is uh, not the recommended way but this is just I wanted to show you like we, we can create the space mostly when you fill the content of div over here it's left and right when you start filling up it automatically starts adjusting the space and it starts growing automatically so we don't need to manually control the height or you know so that's uh, div and I believe we have the structure in place now and I would like to make one last change which I'll be making at the global level within the head okay so let's go like this and this may sound a bit creepy but this will help style type is equal to text what is it text slash CSS whoops why I am messing around too much and in the end let's close this tag style okay now I am going to write a style I am going to write a style for a div tag okay and the style would be something like this so what I want to do is I want to do the padding padding I would I, I wish to apply the padding from the top and that would be like a uh, 10 pixel and I wish to apply a uh, text align colon center and basically what I'm doing is I'm applying this style okay this style to all the devs what are you seeing in the behind okay so let me save it all the spellings are correct let's refresh and you will see the difference so you can see the difference this div was hiding in that corner left corner everyone was doing the same thing right and so what happened is actually I have given the padding from the top so from the top it pushes the content below and try to create a space at the very same time I said create a space uh, uh, I'm sorry uh, push this whole content into the center the way I want if I want to push it to right I can do that all right there's no problem with that so I hope this covers the whole video and this gives you an idea like you know how can you set up the same thing uh, using a div tag or the table tag right so it's your choice again so I hope to see you in the next video because in the next video I'll be covering a small topic called a span tag and after that I'll be covering the forms and that would be the end of this whole series and after that we'll be start we'll start building uh, the whole new website and in the end we'll be publishing that and all blah 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 so if this video helps you in some way then please subscribe to my channel share this video with your friends thank you for watching this good night and take care